Hello guys, this is Revan from Digital Integrity. Today we are going to see some interesting tech news in episode 197. Realme will launch the Tech Life Air Purifier in India next week, and today the company has officially confirmed that it will introduce an appliance in its biggest market on September 30th. In addition to the air purifier, Realme will also launch it the handheld vacuum cleaner and the robot vacuum cleaner in India on next Thursday. From Realme, Realme is launching its Realme washing machine on 1st October 2021. I think this washing machine will start its sales from the Flipkart's big billion days. According to the leaks, Realme G1 appears to be launching soon in the global market as well as the Chinese market, and we have already spotted this device for India in the past. Oppo recently confirmed that it would launch the Oppo F19s in India via Flipkart on September 27th, and Oppo has now teased the launch of new A series smartphone that would be launching on October 1st and will be sold exclusive on Amazon.in. According to the teaser, the name of the device is expected to be the Oppo A55 4G. Moreover, the Oppo A55 5G has earlier been launched in some other markets, but this model is expected to bring support for 4G connectivity. A55 5G packs a Dimensity 7. and processor but we can expect this model to utilize a different chipset Xiaomi is gearing up to expand its smart wearable portfolio Xiaomi will soon launch a new smartwatch in China the Xiaomi Watch Color 2 is confirmed to launch on September 27th in Xiaomi's home country at this event Xiaomi will also unveil its new CV series of smartphones in China Owners of some Galaxy A series and M series smartphones are reporting an auto restart issue. Samsung service centers are charging users of this fact. Samsung service centers are charging users of this faulty devices rupees 5000 to rupees 6000 for motherboard replacement. There is no word from Samsung on this issue yet. The Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra leaks in new renders. It will be having an S Pen slot and the design is similar to the Note 20. It also will be having a P-shaped camera module. Fans have been asking for BGM logo and Crafton has finally revealed it. Since Battlegrounds Mobile India is predominantly referred to as BGMI, Crafton came up with a dedicated logo for the Battle Royale game. Ever since its release, BGMI has gathered over 50 million downloads on Google Play Store and has a great rating of 4.5 stars. iOS players can also enjoy the game as it is available on the Apple App Store. In a surprising streak of events, China has declared all cryptocurrency transactions in the country will be demanded as illegal. China's central bank in a note announced that all transactions involving cryptocurrencies are illegal and cited that serious endangers the safety of people assets. While China is one of the largest cryptocurrency market globally, its impact often has an impact on the global price of cryptocurrencies. Following the Chinese announcement, Bitcoin price fell by more than $2000, that is roughly around rupees 1 1 lakh 47500 over the past few years business has not entirely been good in the desktop laptop and server processor market so far the mobile processor market remains the most lucrative according to the recent reports american chip maker amd is planning to take a bold step the report claims that amd may enter the mobile processor market the report also shows that the company will produce chips for smartphones and tablets and its partner of choice is mediatek Google is in talks with the ByteDance and Facebook to get the data necessary for indexing and the subsequent deliveries of videos from TikTok and Instagram. A Google spokesperson confirmed that the company is in talks with the social media regarding the display of content from TikTok and Instagram in search results. There is no information yet on when this feature will be available, but we don't have much information about the agreements between the companies yet. We know that it is a similar agreement exists between the Google and Twitter. So post from the later do appear in google search results usually such agreements provide from payments in favor of the social network the launch of the iphone 13 lineup was so special in more than one way but the biggest takeaway from the launch was an introduction of what apple calls as promotion in simple words there is a new oled display with a 120 hertz that has been adopted by apple but is only a charm for the iphone 13 pro and the iphone 13 pro max Tag Wear Ultra has been launched in India. This affordable smartwatch sports a dual curved display and a Nordic chipset. It comes with a SensePlus technology that improves the accuracy of the biometric sensor, and it features a 1.69 inch curved display. It has an IP68 rated body and a heart rate sensor. And buyers can choose from 16 kind of straps in 13 different colors from the smartwatch. It includes multiple health tracking sensors. This smartwatch offers up to 10 days of battery life. The Tag Wear 
worldwide price price rate rupees 2999 and in india it is available for purchase through amazon india it comes in three colors like black gray and pink thanks for watching this video please kindly support my channel by giving a like share and subscribe and follow dj integrity on twitter instagram and facebook